Hello, I welcome you all to this another interesting screencast. Uh, the problem reads uh, the car travels up the hill with a speed of v equal to 0.2 s, where s is in meters. Measured from A, determine the magnitude of this acceleration when it is at point S equal to 50 meters, where rho is equal to 500 meters. The problem is coming from uh, the uh, mechanics, I mean engineering uh, mechanics dynamics 14th edition by RSC Kibela. So let's call this point here as our B. Okay, this point as our B. Okay, so we have a car moving from A to B, and the distance covered is 50 meters. We've been asked to determine the magnitude of the acceleration. Our V itself is being defined as a function of distance, which is point to S. This is our V. Okay, and it's in meters per second. Okay, and then what do we have? We have uh, acceleration. So we know how these they relate, right? Acceleration itself is just equal to ATUT like so plus AN UN. These ones UT and UN are unit vectors in those directions in the T and the U axis. And then we know that our AT itself is just going to be equal to and V dot, which is equal to a dV dt. In our case there, we do have an S, so we can use chain rule. So this becomes a dV dS by dS dt. So let our dt dS just be equal to our V. Okay. So therefore, our V at uh, S equal to 50 meters, S equal to 50 meters, we calculate the value. This is just going to be equal to uh, 0 0.2 by 50, um, which just becomes a 2 times 5, therefore this is equal to a 10, right? It's a 10, of course. Okay, so, and then we have our D, dv, our ds, which is just equal to our dv, I mean our v, which is 0.2s, like so. This is equal to just a 0.2. Therefore, our AT, our AT is just going to be equal to uh, dV dS by V, right? Which is equal to 0 0.2 by 10. Okay, therefore, our AT is just equal to 2 meters per second square. Therefore, A, B, T is equal to A, T, which is equal to 2 meters per second square. So, found one part. Let's find the other part. Um, the other part says our A, N is just equal to V squared divided by rho. And we know to say our V here is equal to, uh, we found our V, what was our V? Our V is equal to uh, 10 meters per second. Remember this value here? Okay. And then our rho is also equal to 500 meters. Therefore, An is just going to be equal to 10 squared divided by 500 and this is equal to as 100 squared which is I just say 10 squared which is 100 divided by 500 
So this gives us a 0 0.2 meters per second. All right, therefore A, B, N is just equal to our A, N, which is equal to 0 0.2 meters per second square. A using the Pythagoras theorem is just equal to A, B, T squared plus A, B, N squared. Therefore, our A is just equal to 2 squared plus 0.2 squared. Okay, square root of that gives us just a 2. A 2.01 meters per second square. Right, so let's draw this. So we have we have something like so here. Then we have something like so. And then we do have something uh like so okay so this is a this is a t okay this is a t and then this is a n which is the central pitot uh acceleration and then we have the final solution there, which is the acceleration at B. And it's just equal to 2.1, 2.01. All right, so I hope this video was helpful. And if it was, give me a thumbs up, like my video, continue subscribing, liking my channel. Bye-bye. And I'll see you in my next uh, screencast.